Well, Katle Hama, say my mouth's watering after that. I hope you're saving a piece or a bite for me there. Now, since moving to Cape Town from Pretoria, I've been spending every second day on the beach. And no, after three and a half months in Cape Town, I haven't gotten sick of the beach yet. The weather in Cape Town has been fantastic. And the one thing that I've noticed about living in Cape Town and spending time on the beaches, there are always the girls dressed in the most amazing bikinis that I've never seen before. So I thought we'd get a bit of a sneak peek of a new range that's coming into South Africa. It's called Pull In. So I should say a new range that's pulling into South Africa. And I've got Peter Schmidt here to tell us more about this range. Welcome to Expresso. Thanks very much. Now tell us about this new range, Pull In. First of all, why aren't you wearing any? Uh, did you bring my size? Uh, I think so. Uh, any excuse to wear a bikini because <laughs> then I can go straight to the beach after work. Cool, excellent. <laughs> Okay, so Pullin is a it's a um, it's a French brand. Mm. Um, we bring it to South Africa. Um, started ten years ago. It's a luxury brand. It's not um, a brand that is for everybody. Mm. It's kind of pretty unique in its in its style. Started off as an underwear brand, mm. um, breakthrough brand in the sense of taking un men's underwear and putting colours and, and yes. bright patterns and making from lycra. Um, and then natural progression for, as it started off in extreme sport was into um, swimwear. Yeah. So. But now you said it's a French brand. It's a French what brand. What relevance does it have to South Africa? I think um, from several points of view, Pullin as the, uh, the brand name mm -hmm. um, is a term that we use so often in South Africa across all yes. groups. Yes, Pullin. And, yeah, Pullin dude, <laughs> Pullin brew. And um, so it has a relevance there. It also mm -hmm. kind of it's something that is um, with its roots in extreme sport kind of gives something to adventurous people in South Africa. Also in South Africa really we don't find a huge variety compared with say that mm -hmm. in, in, in Europe or in the US. Um, and as a result, this brings something more to, mm. to South Africans. And it's nice. I love the style. I like the ladies, the little shorties that she's wearing, the red and two-piece. The, um, we have about seven different cuts yep. of bottoms and, mm. and tops. So you can basically create a style to, to, to match your mood, depending on the day. Now, what about people who feel they don't have a bikini body? Is it for everyone? We, well, we do both um, mm. one pieces and bikinis. Mm. So we've got really something for everybody in the sense of um, if we considering the people who would go mm. for Pullin as a brand. Pullin really as a brand is, is for people who don't want to do what everybody else yes. is doing, who, want to, who are a little bit more creative, mm. don't follow the status quo, kind of the trendsetters. Um, we, don't, we don't expect to be seeing it on everybody. And where is it available? Um, at the moment, uh, it's not available anywhere yet, but we will be so updating. So we're getting the sneak peek We're getting the sneak the peek, that's right, yeah. We're going to be putting uh, information on our Facebook page, mm. um, facebook.com forward slash pull in SA. Or uh, you can check out my blog on, on Expresso Show. On Expresso as well, yeah. yeah. Um, where we'll be notifying fans about when it's going to be available. But we're, no we're negotiating with some high-end retailers, um, some premium premium brand retailers. And now heading to the beach, what's your summer tip for anyone out there? Uh, put on sunscreen. Always put on Always sun. put on Before sunscreen. Before you put on your bikini or your shorts, put on sunscreen. Put on sunscreen, yeah. Now talk us through the men's range, because it originally started as a, as a men's that's, range. That's right, yeah, it started off in, in, in men's underwear. And um, so what we've got now is we've got a number of different um, men's cuts, mm. so from, from the um, full length board shorts, yeah. um, all the way through to a tighter fitting um, shorty. I love um, those tighter fitting yeah. shorties. So, um, and in a wide range and variety of colors and, and and patterns which um were slightly different yes. to the traditional kind of surf board short type thing. I think we need um, Max to walk again so that all the ladies can, yeah. can take a look at him again looking that fine in his pull ins or pull in, <laughs> should I say. Very nice brand. Yeah, and it's a it's a, it's a great brand. And I, I discovered it when I was living in France and uh, fell in love with it. And as soon as I knew I was moving to South mm. Africa, I thought we've got to bring this to South Africa. It just it really should work. And now for guys, what's the age range that you you're targeting? Um, it's not about an it's not about an age. It's about an attitude. I yeah. think that's really more important. I think we're seeing people from um, <laughs> 15 to 50 wearing pull-in. So um, it's uh, it's 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 about the attitude. It's about the attitude that you've got. Fantastic. We're having so much fun yeah. here checking out the models. I'm sure you agree. It's Nice to see the nice summer range coming in and nice to see the ladies and some eye candy or should I say guy candy for the ladies. <laughs> Peter, thank you so much for joining Thanks, us and Liesl. introducing us to your fabulous range. We're going to have to get another pair on set so that Kia and I can, can wear a pair. <laughs> I want to see it. Yeah, we'll definitely do it. Great. And we'll prance it on the beach or we'll pull, on, pull in onto pull the in. beach and wear it. Mm. So stay with us here on Express. So we're going to be chatting to Matthew Mulman a bit later on. We're also going to be learning to bry or checking out the bry with Jan Bry. Still all on the way here on Expresso.